<laughs> Wolfish here, Wolf back, welcome back. Today got uh, another horror game uh, with uh, pretty good reviews. Apparently there's a story behind this as well. The reason why I'm saying this is... Um, get me playing as this girl, you see here. And she broke up with her ex. And now she's being stalked. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's the entire story apparently. Uh, let's see where this takes us. Um, I hope there's gonna be some kind of... I'm hoping for a good story, basically. Had to break up with Liam, and I hope he takes it well. Oh yeah, of course. If he did, we wouldn't have a game, I suppose. It's always a nice thing, nice touch, when we can actually run. It won't take ages for us to do stuff. Need to make some food, I'm hungry. Bruh, just eat some chips. Eat some chips, really. You don't have to cook. I like the decker. Oh, wow. The bathroom is huge as well. I guess the reason why we can open pretty much everything is just um, maybe we'll have to hide. If the guy is going to be following us um, around the house or something. Okay, guess I'll just follow the instructions, uh, whatever she says. Huh. <laughs> What, what do you want to eat? Don't have anything, just a bowl of ketchup? Okay, cooking simulator. Okay. Bro. Don't have anything. Organic food, what the hell? What is that? Oh, okay. So just, uh, this comes out of, out of one can. Who would be knocking at my door at this hour? Oh yeah, someone is knocking. Just need to readjust the sound. Okay, much better. I couldn't even hear what she was saying. Huh. Okay, okay, hold your horses, I'm coming, bro. Who's there? Hey honey, can I come in? Liam, I told you it's over, so no, you can't come in. Come on, just... You can't li just leave me like that. I love you more than anything. I told you it's over. Go home. Open the door, Kate. No, I'm not opening the door. I don't love you anymore, Liam. You'll be mine again soon. Bruh, what? It's kind of desperate. Sounds like he walked away, thank God. I don't think so. Anyway. We should be ready now. Mmm, delicious. How come it sounded like I just ate a bag of potato chips? A bath to calm myself down. Oh yeah, like a typical horror game scene, a uh, horror movie scene. Uh, a girl taking a bath and then someone is uh, creeping up behind her. What the? I need to act surprised. What the? Someone sounded like someone broke a glass somewhere or a window. Give me another chance, please. I'll treat you well and <laughs> do anything you want, I promise. Just one chance is all I ask. That can't be too much, can it? XO, XO. No, I gotta leave before he does something worse. Bruh, really? You, <laughs> you, you, throw, you throw a boulder with a note like that. How did he even reach it? So, so high up, bro. It's kind of heavy as well. Yeah. Okay, anyway, uh... So, bruh. What the? Bruh. <laughs> what? It's like... It's like that game with a neighbor, with a creepy neighbor, right? Bro, what the fuck? Okay, so I guess I need to... 
Uh-huh. Call 911. Why are you call calling your grandpa, bro? Oh, God. Hi, grandpa. I need your help. Hey, Kate. What's going on? Liam broke into my apartment and chased me. I barely got away. And now I'm in my car with nowhere to go. That's horrible. Are you okay? Did, did, did he hurt you or something? Oh, I got away before he could do something, but I'm terrified he'll get me okay I assume you're looking for a space to stay for a while yes you can come live with me for as long as you want however I'm going to be out on a business trip for a week that's fine uh, it's still gonna be safer than staying here can I go there right now yes I'll send you the address the key is uh, to my house in a flower pot also remember to keep those doors locked and need a, and if you need to go outside you can always check the people first uh bro like i mean she's a grown-up boobon right she's not a kid uh, oh thanks grandpa you're a lifesaver no problem i hope all goes well and don't hesitate to call me again bro god damn it bro you're not gonna lock your door really I don't need to drive, right? Okay, thank God. That was close call. That was a close call, thank God I made it out. Liam won't be able to find me anymore now. How do you know? I've finally broken free from this toxic relationship. I'm pretty sure he has a tracker on the car or something, bro. <laughs> For a second there, I thought that's gonna be the, the end. Okay. What's going on? I can't... Oh no. Did he manage to follow me? Yep, and without lights on, and the moment she turned around, the car... Getting too paranoid. Of course it's not him, probably just a neighbor. Bro, he's driving with his lights off, and the moment he saw you turning ar turn around, he he drove somewhere else. Uh, press F to turn on your flashlight. Okay. Uh, flower pot. Which flower pot was that? Oh, it's dark in here. Let's turn some lights on. L lights on and find the bedroom. I want to hit the bed. A A S A P. I'm sorry to say this, Han, but something tells me it won't happen. I wonder if it's just gonna be the axe or if something's wrong with this house as well. <laughs> That's gonna be interesting. Um, should I should I be um, closing any blinds or something? She did say she wanted just to hit the bed and empty fridge, okay. Oh, that's creepy. Okay. Okay, bad it is, but I just want to see um, the layout of the house first. Huh, this one's locked. Find the bedroom. Okay, I guess... I mean... What? Sound like someone opened a door somewhere. Lily, lily, lily. It's a huge ass house. I mean, okay, and then someone's gonna break in, right?
Wow, I slept that long. Okay, seems like it's just a chill day. Is Grandpa home already? I was about to say it's a chill day. The birds are singing. It's very sunny. It's not the night time, which is always nice. So I knocks on the door. Bruh. You already know what's gonna happen, right? Can I peek through the window? Whose car is that? I think it's just my car. People first. Okay, so Grandpa did say not to open the door. Can you use the peephole first. So yeah, I guess that's what I'm gonna be doing. Unless I have to open the door, you know. Why is that book sticking out like that? History of art. As if as if it's like a switch for a hidden door or something. Well, I guess I have no choice, right? Do I open the door? Hello. Oh, oh, oh crap. Hello? Hello? Yeah, that's my car. Do I need to investigate now? Check the door. Yeah, I already checked the door, bro. I'm outside. What else do you want me to check? Okay, maybe it's the other door. Yeah, no one's here. Okay, door is checked. This one's locked, and this one's locked as well. Is there another door on this floor? I don't think so, just like these two. Still keep saying that I have to check the door. What about the second floor? Hello. Oh, okay. Somehow I missed that. Dearest new resident of this mansion. I'm the previous owner of this mansion and you are the person I have been looking for. I hope to see you stick around for a while. I'm sure you'll get along just we'll, we'll get along just fine. I'll be watching you. Watching me. That's strange. <laughs> yeah, you don't say. I need to get going to the store before it gets dark soon. Uh, let's be careful. Okay. So there's now two stalkers. Got away from one, and well now we got a new interesting neighbor. I'm pretty sure it's the guy though, right? What's that? Some kind of paper. Okay. Well, wow, it's creepy how similar she looks to me. Missing person, what? Okay, Ashley, missing since blah blah blah, 
Please help us bring Ashley home. If you have any information, even the smallest detail, contact the police. Your assistance could make all the difference. Hope they find her. That's horrible. Okay. Right. Bro? Oh! Oh, hi there. Haven't seen you here before. How are you new? Yeah, I just moved in. Bro, I can't even look up at him. <laughs> Where do you live? I don't feel comfortable telling you that. Are you alone? What the... F <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm, I'm in a hurry. Sorry, I gotta go. <laughs> Bro, what are you even doing here? You're not even doing anything. Okay, anyway. Bruh. Is that your brother? Uh... Okay, canned food. I guess tuna will do, right? No? Or is she, am I looking for that, like, universal... Do I need to get, like, a... Okay, okay, so... Buy groceries. Yeah, that's fine. Do I, do I pick this up, or...? Yeah, I'm trying to pick up this shopping basket, bro, but... What? Collect items from top to bottom. Okay. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, organic food. Check. Snacks from top to bottom. Mm, what kind of snacks? Did I put this in the uh, shopping? No? Okay. Chips. Some soda. Oh, the guy is living, thank God. Soda. There is, I mean, yeah, got guys. So, uh, milk, cereal, and of course, wine. That's all. Let's go pay for this now. Okay. <laughs> Hello, is that all? <laughs> yes. All right, that's all. Is twenty-two bucks. Thank you for shopping. I'm not sure, not too long, I would assume. Oh, so I guess he asked for how long we're gonna be staying here. Alright, have a good day, and here are your groceries. Okay, thank you. Not awkward at all. <laughs> Jesus Christ, what the fuck, bro? You know, a young, beautiful lady like you shouldn't be out alone, alone. What the fuck? Bro, it's like. It's like full of stalkers and creepy dudes, this town or city or whatever. Jesus Christ, this guy was hiding behind the car. I thought it was like her ex. What do you want? I do have some wishes, but I think it's best they remain unspoken. What the f- <laughs> Be careful and don't let me catch you all alone again. Who, who even says that? I don't need your warnings. Respect my space and stay away. I hope I got... yes. So I'm driving away on my own, right? Right? No one's following me. I'm not... I'm not being kidnapped. Let's not forget the groceries. Okay, bro. Okay. The doors are locked. Excellent. I guess I just put this... Um... Yeah? Oh boy, that's why the flashlight was on. I was like, for a second, I was like, why are you using your flashlight on your phone? Okay, that explains it. Welcome home. Yep. Okay. So, what... You look beautiful in the store today. Bro. 
can't wait to see you again. And it's so convenient that the grandpa decided to go on his business trip. Bro. He's here outside, Jesus Christ. Bro. Bro, I don't know why I just got creeped out like the moment I heard someone walking around. Oh god. What happens if we get caught? Ah oh, jeez. Wait, I want to check. I'm going to check the door in a second, but I just want to see, just want to make sure there is no one else inside the house. So I can just uh, run back in the room and hide. Jesus, bro. Hello? Like, obviously, you received those texts on your phone, right? You're not gonna be answering the door now. I do need to do something about the electricity though. Check the door, bro, come on, like, why are you forcing me to open the door? I don't want to. Oh god. Is that the car or... can't see shit. Um, anything in the window? Can't tell. Okay, I mean, there's only one way to find out, right? Hello. Bro. Bro, I'm paranoid. Oh, crap. <gasps> Dearest new resident, congratulations on settling in. You may believe this mansion is your ref refuge, but every step you take reveals a deeper game. I'm with you in every choice, every move. There is no escape from becoming mine. Okay, okay. See ya. Bye. Okay. Drive away! Yellow. <laughs> oh no. Here, I thought it's gonna be too easy. Please start, come on. Not, uh... Yeah. Something is really wrong. I have to get inside and call the cops like right now. Why don't you stay in the car and call the cops? Oh, and the door is open. Why is the door open? Okay. Call the police. Um it did say something that I I didn't have time to read. So, settings interact flashlight continue dialog blah 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 okay how do I call the police I have to call the police okay it's convenient bro this is stressing me out what's your emer emergency I need help I've been receiving threatening messages letters and texts I'm really really scared uh, I'm here to help you can you Give me your location. I'm at this. It's urgent. I understand. I'm dispatching officers to your location right away. Can you describe the nature of the threats? They've been watching me, following me. The messages are getting more intense. Please hurry. Stay in line with me. Uh, help is on the way. In the meantime, try to find a safe and secure location within your home. Okay. I mean... I wonder if it's that... Uh, bedroom, not bedroom, but the room with the books and everything. Make sure you lock, lock all the doors. Um, the officer should be here soon. Okay. Pretty sure this one is locked as well. Yep. Okay, safest room. I mean... It'd be pretty stupid to hide in the bedroom, right? 
right? Arr Make sure you lock your doors. The officer should be there soon, okay? Lily. Li. Do you have just Yes they they're locked. Someone just tried to open the door. Officers will be there in a s any second now. <laughs> okay. Yay! The police are here, and guess what? It's not the real police. How come they, um... It appears that everything is under control now. Our officers apprehend a man in a white van outside your residence. That is too fast and too convenient. Too good to be true. Are you sure? I didn't trust that. Where's the van? Where's the police car? Bro, you know what I think? I think the phone was hacked and it's actually a spoofed number. It's not 911. <laughs> There's no way, right? We're bringing him for questioning. If something else happens, don't hesitate to call us. Take care. Thank you for your help. I'll be sure to uh, reach out if something else happens. You do realize that was BS most likely, right? Phew, what a relief. I never thought I'd feel safe again, but maybe things can get back to normal now. They won't? Uh, should be safe. Let's uh, let's head to the basement outside and restore the power. Really? Bro, in the middle of the night? Don't think it's a good idea, to be honest, but I guess here goes nothing. Li li li. Bro, that is such bull. I really... I'm really suspicious. Why is the basement open? And I don't trust that the fact that the police have been here so fast. Where's the power outlet? Literally. What the? Okay. Jesus, that, that scared me, bro. I... Crap. Oh boy. <laughs> Fuck, I have goosebumps, man. I really don't like this feeling. Oof. Okay. I stink of sweat. Let's take a bath before I go to bed. No, I think I should check the house first, right? Right? What's up with the clock and the wall here? Yeah, I'm gonna check upstairs. I really don't like that. All of the doors? Yep. Hello? All clear? Okay, so the coast is clear, which means I can feel it, bro. Something definitely is gonna happen once I start taking bath. Ah, just chilling. Finally, a moment of peace. And then, surprise! But why w would a stranger go so far for me? Whatever, it's over now. 
Is it? Mm hmm. I'm so exhausted and I'm hearing this now. Let's just go to bed. I have so many questions. Number one, why is there no mm, curtain in the shower? Number two, why are you taking a shower uh, bathtub with an open door? Number three, at night, why don't you use close your blinds or curtains, right, for privacy reasons? And it's like literally you left everything open for people to see. Is the door locked? Okay. Bro, that plan just scared me. What was that sound, bro? Uh oh. Good question, bro. I do wonder myself what noise that is. Sounds like it's coming from the storage room. Sounds like someone's... And bro, the noise is so random as well. <laughs> what the... Uh, bro, I don't know what's what's scarier to play these kinds of games or like some paranormal ones. I really don't know. I didn't expect anything like this. Like obviously, I was expecting a jump scare, but it's just like all of a sudden, Jesus Christ! Should probably call and check how Liam is doing. I mean, the reason all this is happening to begin with is because I broke up with him. It's all my fault. Uh, if I had just stayed with him, he would have kept me safe. Uh, you don't have to gaslight yourself. No. Of course not. What am I thinking? Let's put my mind something else. Put. But first, let's make sure that the house is empty. Still don't feel safe. Wait. I wonder if you actually call the guy and then you hear the phone ring somewhere inside the house. Just a guess. Uh, but either way, we'll find out, I guess. Lily, Lily. Something looks off about that book. See, bro, I told you at the very beginning. I knew it. It's like... Yep, that's so. What's up with the sinister music? Rural news. A sudden disappearance, Ashley's whereabouts unknown. 27-year-old Ashley was reported missing on August 15, 2013 by her husband, two days after she disappeared from their home. Last seen uh, in the residence, Ashley's sudden absence has raised suspicion, with her husband emerging as a prime person of interest in the ongoing investigation. Is it the grandpa or the previous owner then? Wait, or is it the neighbor? While authorities continue to search for leads, uh, they urge anyone with the information to come forward and assist in the search for Ashley, where she was last seen. Bro, is it... Is it our house? Yeah, right? Okay, uh, where's the storage room again? Look honey, we made the news pretty cool, right? 2013 I can't replace you, Ashley. There is no one that is as special as you. 
Why did you force me to do this? I never wanted to harm you. My fault? How is this my fault? How is it my fault? I didn't want it to end like this. You left me with no other options. What the fuck did I do? How am I gonna live without you? What's the point of all of this? I'm tapping into a dead person. I would do anything to get you back. Ooh, so this girl's ex used to be with someone else then, 10 years ago, and killed her, and then, and that that girl actually, now he found it, he found this girl, the main character, who also looks like X, to replace her. Am I dreaming? I swear that is you. She looks just like you. Have you come back to me 10 years later? Yep. She's just as beautiful as you were. Ah, uh, were. She has to become mine. She will, no matter what. I can't let her run away from me like you did one, like you once did. Uh, but I. This is so confusing. We're in our. This is our grandpa's house, right? So. What? How? Why would you want to leave me? I have done nothing but be good to you. Uh, whatever, it, whatever, it doesn't matter anymore. You are never leaving me again now. It's probably about time I talk to Grandpa about what's going on here. This is crazy. What the hell? It's a skull. He's not gonna pick up, right? Yes, has something happened? A lot is happening. I've received a creepy, I received creepy letters, um, and been followed by someone. I don't think it's Liam. I called the police, and they arrested a suspicious individual lurking around the house. But when I thought it was all over, I found a strange hidden room in your house that contains some psychotic things, to say the least. What? Wow, that's insane. Maybe the police arrested the guy leaving the letters, and a uh, hidden room. I've lived there for ten years. I never seen that. I'll be cutting this business trip short and coming back home as soon as possible. Can't stand not being able to help you. Yeah, okay, so Grandpa had nothing to do with this. I'd like to think they arrested him, but uh, what if they didn't? What if he's still out there? What if they arrested someone who got set up? Uh, it makes me so easy just thinking about it. Uh, what do you remember about the person you bought this place from? Uh, this could definitely be the case. I remember that his wife had recently gone missing without a trace. It was uh, the talk of the town for quite a while. And his name was... Are you serious? My phone ran out of battery and I didn't have time to bring my charger with me. Okay. Let's get a flashlight in case I need one later. I think I remember seeing one in the basement. You... Why you have to do this, bro? It's locked. Okay. Why you have to go to the basement without your flashlight, man? Going to the basement? Yeah, going to the basement without a flashlight to get a flashlight. Why is everything so reddish now? Okay, the coast is clear. No one's following me, right? Oh boy. Flashlight. Yoink. Okay. You <laughs> little. <laughs> Every single time, bro. Every single time. And a fucking crow this time. I got scared by a bird. Oh. <sighs> Why, bro? If you want to scare me, please use something like really creepy. Don't use a bird. Please. Game. Okay, got that. Should search for a weapon just in case. Uh, let's start by looking through Grandpa's office upstairs. Bro, like, won't find any weapons outside. Yeah, you won't. But at the same time, you could have. 
taken the knife from the kitchen or something, right? Okay, I got the key. Is it from the cellar? Hey, 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 come on. Yeah, there is a key. Bro. Okay. To interact. Uh, LMB, to move, to sprint. Okay. Yeah. Oh, there is another, another letter there. Can I uh, maybe reassign this? Settings. Um, left mouse button. Yeah. Okay, okay, bro. I. Hmm, yummy. There is nothing of use here. What do you mean, bro? What about the key? How can that be in. Okay, I guess that's for later. There has to be grandpa, right? <laughs> oh god. Bro, you just had a call with him like a minute ago, literally. <laughs> Bro, I'm literally being scared like uh, like a girl. I saw I scared you. I just had to to come clean about something. What the fuck? Of course you did. You are the creep that talked to me earlier outside of the convenience store. What do you want to come clean about? I know it was creep, but it wasn't my idea. Liam told me to do it in hopes that you would take him back to feel safe again. I was supposed to take it a step further, but I couldn't do it. I felt too sorry for you. It all makes a lot of sense. Um, it all makes sense now, thank you for telling me. I still don't feel safe around you. Can you leave now, please? Yes, of course, I'm sorry again. Okay. Don't think he left, though. What? Why is it dark all of a sudden? What? Bro, I was just talking to the guy it's night already. Oh yeah, okay, so it's something unusual is happening then. I thought it was maybe it's like a glitch in the matrix or something. <laughs> you know, um, it's like a glitch in the game. Okay, uh, wait, so the lights went out again. Hold on, where's the light switch? Oh, it was already switched on. Not really useful, bro. Still locked. Go to bed, bro. E after everything you've experienced, after everything you've seen, you just want to go to bed. <coughs> ah, what can I say? Some people can sleep uh, in any situation, I guess. Li -li 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 -li. Everything is clear. Door is locked. Off to bed. Did, did, did that come <laughs> from the bedroom door? <laughs> I don't know why it's funny, bro. Yes, it did. What are you gonna do about it now? Do I open it or do I... Okay, fine. I'll read it. You thought this was over. You feel helpless now, don't you? Your car doesn't work. Your phone is dead. The police think they got the person behind this. And you don't know where I am. There is nothing that can stop me anymore. Whoa, 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 what do I do? I know I follow down the other path. I saw... I saw when I first got here. Maybe I can find some neighbors that can help me. Follow other path. Hmm. Hmm, that's gonna be interesting. In the middle of the night. You're not making this easy, do you? Bruh. Arr. 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 
ability okay YOLO I'm just YOLO in this bruh oh bruh okay this is the other path right Something tells me this neighbor is in cahoots with this other guy, or probably that's the guy. Wait, isn't that Liam's car? This is definitely Liam's car. Oh. What a surprise, bro. Wait, the path ends here. What? What the hell? It's a bit creepy. It's like a like a sex dungeon or something, bro. Blood? Where? Oh. Can't be a good sign. Wait a second, it's that's Liam, what happened to you? Why would someone do this to you? So it wasn't Liam after all. She's mine. And only mine. Lily Lily. Is that Liam? Or is that me? Can't tell. I think it's Liam. Well that's what you get, bro. For scaring me and being creepy. Press shift to sprint. Yeah, I am. Which way though? No point to go back outside, right? I guess this is the cellar door. Oh. Oh, and this is his ex. I think uh, these are Ashley's remains. What a sick and a twisted individual her husband is. I don't even want to know what he would do to me. You're about to find out. I said that turning around thinking he's behind me all this time. Okay, going back inside, right? No? Really? You really don't want to go back inside? <coughs> what? This guy is the owner. Hey, I couldn't wait anymore. I need you now, my new Ashley. Bro, he just teleported out of nowhere. What? So it was you who has been sending letters. I know I, lo I know I look similar to your ex, but that doesn't mean I can replace her. I don't care uh, how you look; it's more than enough. Come, come here. I've been waiting so long for this. I have to run. Yes, bro, you have to run. Yes, bro, I got caught. Thank you very much. Yes. Please let there be an autosave. Okay. That's too fast, bro. Come on. Give me a handicap or something. Okay, so. Bro, this music. Ah! 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 Okay, I need to go... Not to the left, not to the left. Okay. Okay. Bruh, ready? Oh no! Oh no! I don't wanna look back, bro. Oh. 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 Bro, this is like some kind of this is like so much like that hello neighbor thing. 
police has arrived on the scene just in time, thanks to Grandpa. Aww. Grandpa is a big bro. He hurried back home after the abrupt ending to Kate's phone call with him. When he arrived home, he realized that Kate was nowhere to be seen. He got a sinking, feeling, sinking gut feeling that the worst might have happened. He called the police instantly and they made it just in time. The relief Grandpa felt after the news was like nothing else. What happened to everyone else involved? Uh, the man in the white van said that uh, his reasoning for being outside Kate's home was because he saw a stranger following her home from the store. Of course, the police didn't believe him uh, when they saw that no one else was there. But then, when the news broke free about this, the police realized their mistake and that they had actually been telling that the act that the guy had been telling the truth this whole time. He was released on the same day. Liam's accomplice was never seen again after the incident. The psychopath who killed his ex-wife Ashley, Liam, and almost Kate ended up getting sentenced to life in prison. Kate is doing her best to recover from the incident, but it's difficult. Uh, at night, she often hears uh, those daunting knocks on the bedroom door, disrupting her attempts to sleep. Throughout every day, she finds herself checking behind and scanning every corner, consumed by fear and paranoia. Thanks for playing. Yeah, thanks for making the game, bro. Yeah, it's... Um... Okay, I'm not gonna lie. The jump scares, <laughs> it's not what I was expecting. Uh, these were good, but like... It was a bit annoying to get uh, scared by a crow. by like, uh, Literally by a bird, okay? The story was good. I was just expecting some uh, simple story about an ex stalking you and stuff, but turns out it's just like a huge mess in a good sense, in a good way. Uh, but anyway, I'll be seeing you in the next one.